In this video, uh, we're going to talk about how to insert animations to your slides so that the text can be animated. So step one, I'm going to go to slide two, one of the slides that has text on it, and I'm going to click on one of the text boxes, either the title or the paragraph text. Now, to get the animation menu, I can either right-click inside a text box and press animate, or while one of the text boxes is selected, I can go to insert and choose animation. Either way, we'll get you there. So I'm going to right-click on the title text box and go down and select animate, and the pop-up window will appear. This is much like the themes, um, excuse me, the transitions between slides. So this is my title um, text box because it's yellow, and it says how much, and that matches up to the yellow and how much over here. Right now it's set that the words will fade in, and these are the different animations for the words. I'm going to have these words zoom in when the mouse is clicked. So when I preview the slideshow, excuse me, this slide, the slide will appear and there's no title. When I click the mouse button, you can see that the title will zoom in. So I stop. Now you notice that the paragraph text, the fact, and, and the link were already inserted in the slide when we started the slideshow. So I'm going to add an animation for that as well. So I can press Add Animation, and this is my fact right here. It says Since, and here's the word Since. I'm going to choose to have this one zoom in as well. And we'll talk about this by paragraph checkbox in just a minute. Let's preview this slideshow, or this slide again. So we have the image but no text, and when I click the first time, my title will zoom in. And now when I click again, the fact and the link zoom in. I'm going to press stop to get out of preview mode. If I went back to the paragraph text where the fact and the link were, clicking here, if I click on by paragraph, now when I press play, because I pressed enter, here's, excuse me, here's a click from my title, because I pressed enter, after my fact when I typed it to get down to the link. Now I'll have to click the mouse again for the link to show up. So I'm going to leave it up to you guys if you want it to be by paragraph or not. We'll do one more together just so we can practice. So I'm on the slide three and I would like to animate this slide. I'm going to click inside a text box and I can right click and do animate or go to insert and animation. This is my fact right here, when, so I'm going to choose to have this fact fly in from the right, and I'm going to leave it so that the fact and the link are coming in at once, so I'm not going to check this. I'm also going to add an animation for the title, so I'm going to, excuse me, I have too many animations here, I'm going to X out of this one. I'm going to right click on the title and add an animation for that. So, I'm going to have this one fly in from the left. So let's see how it looks. Here comes our slide, and when I click, here comes the fact, and when I click again, here comes the title. You'll notice the fact came first, so I'm going to press stop. I want to change the order of these. I'll click and drag the title up here, so the title comes first, and the fact comes second. So you can go ahead and add animations to each of the text on your fact slides. Good luck.